Hello friends, in my first video I have shown you how easy it is to import a song from Chordi.com and we did some uh, improvements with it but it's just not finished. As you can see we have chords over the first verse and we have chords over the first chorus but the next verses and the next choruses have haven't any chords there and I think the most of you uh, want to have the chords over the whole song because they want to auto scroll it and uh, don't want to remember every single chord especially if you begin starting with playing guitar or something else so what we will do is it's really easy in this song uh, because the choruses are all the same so we can just copy and paste the first chorus which is ready to use. We select the whole chorus in the editor and then press copy and then we go to the next chorus, delete them and paste in the edited chorus and the same thing with the last so now we have three choruses that are all ready to play what we now will have to do is we have to copy and paste the chords from the first verse here uh, to the second verse and to do this I would I will show you uh, different uh, possibilities to do that. The first and e maybe easiest one is to select the first chord from the opening square bracket to the closing square bracket. Right click and copy and then go to all the places where you need this uh, chord and press paste. You can do this also by pressing the keys command and V as I do here and this we can do also with the next verses. Then we need the next chord and here I will show you uh, another uh, possibility you can click at the place where you need the chord and press insert chord uh, right click you can do this by right clicking or command clicking the uh, mouse button and select insert chord and then you will get an empty square brackets and you all you have to do is to insert an F at this position or what you also can do is pressing Control 1 and then you also get this uh, empty square brackets and can input your chord name. And what I would prefer is copy, select the chord, press Command C for copy, go to the next position, press Command V, and this is the, in my opinion, is the fastest possibility to do this. Okay, a last thing I want to show you is how you can move chords if they are not at the position that you want them to be. So I will show you this uh, with this G chord in the chorus, copy, uh, select the uh, whole chord and then move the chord to the position that you want it to stay and as you can see here in the viewer the um, chord has moved. I'll move it back and you can see the chord moved back.